We are shining the DBL spotlight on beating the odds. 20 year old Dylan McWilliams has done the unthinkable. He has survived a shark attack, a bear attack, and a rattlesnake bite. I talked to him earlier about his misadventures, and I have to warn you, some of the photos of his wounds may be upsetting to some viewers. Take a look. Outdoor enthusiast Dylan McWilliams is not giving up on wild adventures, despite being attacked by three dangerous animals in three years. A shark, bear, and rattlesnake attacked Dylan, and he lived to tell about it. In 2015, on a hike in Utah, he was bit by a rattlesnake. Two years later, while camping in Colorado, a black bear used his mouth to drag Dylan by his head. And just a few weeks ago, Dylan survived a shark attack while surfing in Hawaii. The odds of Dylan's experiences? 893.35 quadrillion to one. So that got us wondering, is he the unluckiest or luckiest person alive? Dylan McWilliams joins us now. First off, Dylan, how do you explain your amazing survivals? I don't know. I mean, it's just lucky or unlucky. It's just, I mean, it's crazy. <laughs> well, that was actually going to be my next question. Do you consider yourself lucky or unlucky? And I guess you consider yourself a little bit of both. Yeah, definitely. So have you made these or have these attacks made you rethink your adventurous spirit? Not at all. I mean, I'm going to be out surfing, going to be out camping, living on the edge, pushing everything to the limit. I mean, I want to do the craziest things in the world. So living on top of the world. Okay. I would be um, a little sad if I didn't ask you, do you play the lottery? Because I would think that with odds like yours, maybe they could work a little bit better in your favor. <laughs> I know everybody tells me I should, but I've never bought a lottery ticket. I think today's the day. Now, what advice do you have if others are ever faced with similar danger? I mean, if you're in a situation like that, just do what your instincts tell you to do. What's next on your adventure list? I plan on going into the Appalachian Mountains in North Carolina and just living like Daniel Boone for a couple months. Just me and my dog and a couple things I'll take and just make everything I need and live off the land. That's amazing. Dylan, thank you so much for joining us and please stay safe out there. Well, thank you.